happy Cockin' Monday, y'all. In honor of the cookbook being released, this week we're featuring another recipe that's in the appetizer section. It was submitted by Lanny Steinbacher, and it's crab dip. With appetizers, you know, one of our many hobbies for Jenna and I is entertaining. Whether it's going to a friend's house or a family member's house or entertaining at our own house, we love to go to any gatherings. And get so, together and have some fun. We love appetizers. We love being able, you know, something so simple as this, you can easily fix it in a couple of hours and take it. We've served it with some chips or a veggie tray and take it to your gathering. You don't have to show up empty handed. That's Perfect. Right. So I'm going to walk you through it, Jenna. It is one block of cream cheese softened. All right. And we've actually used a liner for this. A lot of times with your cheesy and dip stuff, you can either spray it or use a liner. The great thing about using a liner is if you're going somewhere, if you don't have a lot left over, you can just take it out and chunk it. Or even if you're cleaning up after entertaining at your Easy. house, chunk it, no mess, Easy no clean up. So one block of cream cheese. This is two cloves of garlic minced. Love some garlic. Mm. Half a cup of sweet onion chopped. A fourth a cup of mayonnaise. And I've made this with real mayonnaise or Miracle Whip. Sometimes you don't keep mayonnaise on Whichever hand. you have on hand. A fourth of cup of shredded Parmesan cheese. And one six ounce can of crab meat. And that's drained. I had trouble finding um, the six ounce can. I could only find four ounce cans, but the six ounce can does exist. I just had to search on the shelf a little bit. And then you're going to take two teaspoons of sugar. And just get that a little bit mixed up as well as you can, Jenna. The cream cheese is still a little firm, so this makes up the rest of the ingredients. And like I said, this one doesn't take long at all to fix. Um, you're going to cook it on low for t about two hours. My cheese was melted through. And stir it, I'd say stir it once or twice during like the cooking process. With all dips, I mm -hmm. like to do that. I don't like them to scorch or burn on the side. And um, like I said, we've, we've uh, served it with crackers. Or I like the whole veggie idea, especially with my kids in the summertime coming up. Any of the appetizers are great for us because while we're playing outside, I can have an appetizer going and this laid out. And so when they come in, they've got a healthier You're not snack. Tempted to eat candy and stuff yeah. before dinner. You can at least have them eat something somewhat healthy. So um, we hope you enjoy it. Um, we sure did. It was it was a good good appetizer. It's not a full meal, but we like to give you different things. We haven't done an appetizer in a, in while, a while for you, so. Happy crocking, y'all. Y'all have a great week.